Hi guys, and welcome back to another episode of Lake. We are going to be starting on the third day, which is Wednesday, Wednesday morning. I hope you guys are enjoying the series. If you are, be sure to leave a like and subscribe down below. But without further ado, let's get straight on into it. I'm enjoying this quite a bit. I'm enjoying the relaxingness of this game a lot. Alright. It's a new day with some new Good mail, morning, new packages. Oaks. We're starting the day as we always do with a P.O. positive or pet feed, followed by the weather. P.O. positive or pet feed. Dale, what's it gonna be? Okay. Ever had blueberry pie that tasted so good. Mm, mm, mm. Thank you much, Dale. That makes All right, we're gonna go up right now. first. But the weather's first. We'll start a little off little sunny with a few clouds later today. How about some music now? Turn the radio off because you know it's copyright. That park. There we go. Package for 351 Main Street. Right there. That's lighter than I thought. Oh, a movie is. VHS, yo, let's go. It's been so long since I've seen a place like this. Welcome to the Flick Shack. How can I help you? Got a package for you, ma'am. Hold on. You're our new postal worker? Talk about not looking the part. <laughs> um, thank you. Is that a compliment? <laughs> is that a compliment? Trust me, it definitely is. <laughs> well, thank you then. Alrighty. Name's Meredith, by the way. Meredith Weiss. Angie, Eastman. So, what brings you to Providence Oaks? I used to live here, then I didn't, and now I'm back. Grew up here, and now I'm back to do a, a favor for my dad. Oh, grew up here, and now I'm back to do my dad a favor. Ah, I myself have been here for six years. Nice. And what brings you here? Didn't grow up here, came to do myself a favor. <laughs> Touche, Mrs. Eastman. Miss. Uh, how's business? So, how's business? It's, uh, it's booming. People in Providence Oaks sure like their movies. <laughs> I guess it's because there's not much else to do around here. Might as well watch a flick, right? Mm, you certainly have a lot of them. Choice the... is everything. Grem Nothing gremlins. Quite tickles the imagination gremlins like the instead right of gremlins. At the right time. That hmm. movie gave me Maybe nightmares as a kid. Movies. Well, it was nice meeting you, Miss Eastman. Ghostbusters. Uh, call me Angie. And here, someone just returned this, and it should be right up your alley. Oh. The postman always rings twice? <laughs> <sighs> Little on the nose, don't you think? Well, I don't know anything else about you, <laughs> Mrs. Temporary Postal Worker. <laughs> True. <laughs> Miss. But touche, Angie. All right. I'll check it out if I have the time. Take your time. This isn't exactly the most popular flick in the shack. <laughs> and there's plenty of choice, regardless. True. Okay. Well, it was nice meeting you, Miss Angie. Uh, Same voltage. here, Miss Meredith. Back to the present and back to the future. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hope you like The Postman Always Rings Twice. You only have to watch it once. <laughs> Half price bin? Ooh. Distractions. Let's get back. We gotta do our job. There's my bin. There's my bin. I'm right back there. To the uh, right. Right here. Office, I guess. Wait. This side? This side. Ah, this side. Third street. Hundred and four east on third street. Mail delivered. Next up, 
a package. Are we going to get to talk to this person for the package? Seems to be a trend with the packages more so than the mail. Right. 104 on Pine Street. 100, 402 on Pine Street. My brain just messed that up. Okay. Ooh, a hat box. We're going somewhere and getting a fancy hat. Well, they've got a car there, so they're probably home. Commander Grace, we have established communication with ground control. How do you wish to proceed? Tell them we landed the rocket. Ground control, we <laughs> have landed the rocket. <gasps> we will now begin our experiments. Oh. Um, package for the Evans family? Just a minute. Commander Grace, permission to explore? <laughs> permission granted. We're the Evans family. <laughs> nice. Could I just take that? Oh, that looks. She I'm looks so fun. A lunar landing. Sure. Here you go. The nice helmet, right by there. the way. Why? Thank you. Or not? I, I don't actually know. modeled it on the Apollo 11 crew outfit. Wait. What? Meredith? Guilty as charged. <laughs> um, I'm sorry. Who are you? What? For real? You don't recognize I mean, your I old can't, best friend. I mean, I can't. I can't see her? your face. Wait a minute. K. Yo. Great. And now I busted my colander. <laughs> I knew opening the door in this thing was a bad idea. T didn't recognize you with the thing. <laughs> wow, I didn't expect to see you here. That makes two of us. Got me there. You've lived in Providence. You're K. Evans now. You're Kay Evans now? Don't sound so surprised. Yes, <laughs> I married Barry. Evans? I'm sure you remember our high school star quarterback. Mom! Be right there, Commander Grace! Scanning for alien life forms. That's my <laughs> little scientist back there. She's crazy about space travel, as you may have guessed. Even after the whole Challenger thing. Sounds like you're doing great. He's doing I'm a good job. You. Having well, fun and ed somewhat educational right now. Years. So, time flies. So, I heard you were back in town for a while from Maureen. That's mm -hmm. right. I ran into her yesterday at the diner. Your Uncle Stan wasn't there, unfortunately. I must have just missed him. Nope. It's Moe's diner now. Like I said, a lot of things happened while you were away. Also, I work there now. Oh, nice. At the diner. Taking over the family business. That's great. That's great. Maybe I'll drop by sometime. Yeah, we'll see. Ready for oh. a liftoff! Listen, I'm sorry, but I don't really have time for this right now. Can't get stuck on the moon on my own, and I have to get ready for work. See you around, Em. See you around. Good to see you, Kay. Evans! <laughs> Commander Grace, hold up! You'll never guess what I just found. Is it? You can mm. say that again. We missed a lot, but I think what would feel the worst is, like, she said it was our best friend. And, uh, you know, clearly we didn't get an invite to the wedding. That's a little, a little awkward. Uh... All right, I got to go back down. Okay. I can go this way and take a left. near the post office but not quite and take the next left here 
Nobody's crossing. All right, we good. Well, oh, that turn was a little too wide. A little cold this up. Here's your mail. Oh, some photos. Postcard. Hmm. Same handwriting as the one I delivered next door. I'm guessing party invitations? Probably. Well, possibly. I don't know. Is it a welcome back party for me? Oh my gosh, you shouldn't have. <laughs> I don't I don't think that's actually what it is. Alright. Nah. Oh, dang. This one all the way at the bottom. Alright, let's go to the right first. Alright. Look at the way downtown. Whoa! Alright, slow down. Gonna go we're gonna go right. Deliver this bit of mail right here. It's quite realistic in terms of um hey, Mom and I have to wait until neighbors. it's entirely stopped, Siegler, huh? you know? Don't think they ever mentioned them. Oh, it's our place. Oh no. Wow! I curbed it. Oopsies. <laughs> Oopsie daisies. Do do do. Mail for you. Enjoy your mail. Hopefully it's not bills. Alright, we're gonna... gonna do a chuck a yui. Very carefully. 23 point turn. Alright, there we go. Deliver this person's mail at the corner. Oh, it's the cat lady again. We get to see the kitties. Hello, Meryl, dear. So glad you could come by. Oh, it's quite the emergency. Oh, what's wrong, Miss Jenkins? It's poor little Mortimer. Do I need to take him Ill, to the vet? I think. One minute he was full of life, the next he, well, he just wasn't. I mean, I'm not a vet, but he looks fine to me. Awesome. Almost catatonic. He's almost catatonic. Sorry. Heard it when I said it. <laughs> Please, Meredith, be a dear and take poor Mortimer to Mr. Mackey. He runs the bait shop by the lake. He'll know what to do. I'm sorry, but I don't think I can do that. Sure, I'll get right on it. Here, little kitty, sure, come on. I'll get right on it. Here, little kitty, come on. Wonderful. Be nice to Meredith, Mortimer. Don't shed too much hair in her van now. <laughs> Bye, Miss Jenkins. Bye, Meredith. See you soon, Mortimer. Where's the bat? Over there. Okay. My Sorry, little kitty. I'm going to take you the long way around. I need to do some mail. It won't be long. Don't worry.
That's one package. Only one package. I can do it with a cat in here. I guess I'll find out. Dang, this one is far. Ooh, are we get to go through a mountain? Through this secret tunnel. Saw nothing. You you saw nothing, okay? Secret tunnel, secret tunnel. My driving skills aren't the best, okay? I I get it. <laughs> I got this dead, okay? Ah, it's so peaceful. This would both be nice and, uh, I guess tricky, even trickier to, s to steer maybe if it was first person. Ooh, a motel. Hotel, motel. Okay. My kitty cat. <laughs> uh, office right here. Hello. Hello, sir. Parcel for you. Dang, that's a nice job. Just play, just play video games. I'm not disturbing you. Um, <laughs> I hope I'm not disturbing, but here's a parcel for you. One minute, I'm busy. Okay, sir. <laughs> Getting a high score. That a parcel Kill for that me? mob. Yes, sir. Oregon Trail Motel. You can just put it on the counter. All right. All right. Have a nice day. Good luck with your dungeon, sir. Or, or whatever you're doing. It must be online, he can't pause it. <laughs> Alright, time to get that kitty cat where it needs to go. Up the top. To the vet. What do you think happens if I if I were to like hit another car? What do you think would happen? <laughs> Used to think our Spanner Dam was just as big and famous as Hoover Dam. Then I visited Hoover Dam. Yep. <laughs> Small town thought. To the veterinary clinic. Bye, Moe's Diner. Oh shoot. Oh no. I looked away for two seconds. This is why you don't use your phone while you drive, guys. You look away for two seconds. I wasn't even looking at my phone, but that's why... <laughs> that's why you don't do that. Could be.
Let me get the cat out of the trunk. Out of the boot. Hey. Come here. Pick up. There we go. A long day full of lots of parcels and a cat drop off. Um, do I go this way? Little wharf. Be so nice to yeah go out on a boat out here. Excuse me, sir. Mr. Mackey, I know you're closed, but what? I'm Meredith Weiss. Yeah, yeah, Meredith Weiss. Thomas kid. I remember yeah. you running around the lake when you were yay high, getting into <laughs> all sorts of trouble. What can oh. I do you for? Mildred Jenkins tells me you know a lot about animals and well <laughs> Oh, hi there, little fellow. What's your name? Apparently it's Mortimer. Well, pleased to meet you, Mort. Hmm, he's a little sluggish. Has Millie been feeding him cupcakes again? Probably. To be honest, I have no idea. <sighs> Leave him <laughs> with me, I'll put him on a diet today. Maybe even catch him a fish if they're biting. With any luck, he should be up and running in the morning. Alrighty. Sounds good? Sure thing. Goodbye, Miss Weiss. Okay. Bye, Bye. Mr. Mackey. Bye, Mortimer. Back to the post office. You know, we have a lot of mail in our bag at the end of every day. I know it's for aesthetics, you know, but... <laughs> our bag's never quite empty. Alright, this will just be an 11 point turn. Yep, there we go. I'm going to take to the left. Ooh, it stuttered a little bit. I went on a trip in our favorite postman's truck. Zooming on the road. Next right. Hello. Whoop. There you go. Yes, sir. Made it. Good day's work. Is that mom again? There it is. Hi. Oh, oh hi, Steve. How are you? Busy as two peas. Added 87 is really getting there. Hey, listen, you got plenty of time, right? There's not, uh, I guess. But that's nice for a change, yeah. I guess, but that's nice for a change. Awesome, I need a favor. <laughs> I sent a bunch of files your way. It's Did not read any. Read. Listen it's to good, what we said. But not great. It needs your magic. Do yeah, you yeah, think yeah. you can add it? <laughs> when do you need the feedback? I'm not sure. How many pages are we talking here? Uh, I'm not sure. How many pages are we talking about here? It's not much. It's just a pitch, and there's also an instruction booklet. Can't be more than a hundred pages. Hundred. I send it to your post office, right? Yep. Can't miss. I guess. I guess. Awesome. Mail back to me as soon as possible. Priority mail. Thanks so much. Oh, I gotta run. Okay, Steve. Oh, one final thing. Now let this marinate. <clears throat> add it. Eighty-seven. Add anything you like. It's fancy, right? Yeah. Don't, don't tell me now. Uh, I got a jet. Bye. So wait, why were we working super hard when they were all partying that weekend? And yeah, and now we're on a, a quote-unquote holiday break, but, you know. Ah. 
We're expected to do all of this. Are we getting paid extra for being on break but having to do work? Like, not cool, man. Not cool. Alright. Well, let's watch this. Oh, Steve's parcel. And a note from Tess. Hey, Em. Hope you're doing well. Steve told me you'd want to read through this monstrosity. I would sure want to. I don't that, want to. There anyways. Exactly. Care, Tess. Yeah, I'm not sure if you said that. Because I didn't. I didn't say I want to. I'm like, yeah, I guess I can. I need to. That concludes the Wednesday, day three of the game lake i hope you guys are enjoying me playing and just watching and hanging out and uh i swear i didn't crash <laughs> don't don't comment anything about that okay if you are enjoying the series be sure to leave a like and subscribe down below to be notified of when i upload another video and so that it pops in your subscription box but until next time i hope you guys have a wonderful wonderful rest of your day and i'll see you guys next time bye guys